What is going on everybody? Welcome back to another episode of Buck Fever. So we're actually going to go hunting here in a little bit. Uh, we're actually going to a property that I've hunted once. And my cousin just bought it this year. Just a couple months ago they just bought it. I don't even remember. I don't even know how big it is. Like how many acres or anything. I know they've had a nice buck on it. A nice 8 pointer and a small 8 pointer and a couple does. So basically we're going to shoot whatever comes out. And he just missed a deer there. So we're going to give him a call and see what he can tell us. If he answers. <laughs> Well, he didn't answer. So, we'll text him to call me back. Because we want to know what, what's going on. Because we really want to see something. I'm pretty sure we're on Dole Patrol. Because we'll shoot anything. It's already November 28th. Season's been slow. Haven't really been seeing the things that we want to see. So, kind of just shooting whatever. Whatever comes out, basically. So, it's tight figure right now. Let's see what he has to say. He's on the phone right now. <laughs> so, hopefully, we'll be able to call him later and get some get some details. So, stay tuned because you don't want to miss the rest of this because we're on Doe Patrol. We are going to shoot something in this morning because they've had a lot of activity in the morning with rifle hunting being just gotten done. I think we're going to see something. And you don't want to see So obviously we couldn't get it done today. Um, basically it's just a just a checkers game. You make a move, they make a move, you make a move, they make a move, and not every day is gonna be perfect. Uh, going out there, we did see two deer not too far away from the property, and then going to the blind, spooked that doe out like I said, and then we had a nice eight pointer. I'm guessing it was an eight pointer come in. And I never got close enough to even make a move on it to make a shot. It had to been like 90 plus yards. So I could see it moving around looking and stuff like that. But other than that, like it didn't even give us an opportunity. And that's just how it goes sometimes. So hopefully tomorrow we can get back out there. And next time when we do go out there and hunt the morning, I have a better idea of when to be out there. Because I know I, I got out there way too late and I was saying that. I got out there too late and walking out there <clears throat> uh, a deer ran across so 
if we would have been set up the time that in my head I wanted to be set up at like dark and then watch it get light, I think we would have had a nice shot at it. So, I mean, all you can really do is just make a mistake and then learn from it. I mean, that's just how hunting goes and I think we learned a lot today. And we're always learning and we're never gonna stop learning. So, we got it. We're gonna get it done. We're gonna get it done. So, hopefully the next time I talk or see you guys, we'll have a deer on the ground. Peace.